many scapegoats back in my summer car. I fixed it. I totally fixed it. And guess what I did? You want to know what the problem was? I don't know. I have no idea. It just started working. Um, what I did do, though, was I did install uh, the mod loader and put the optimization mod in um, to make the game run a little better. Because after I reinstalled the game several times, which is why my flag is not right, uh, it was not running where the crap. But, so, here's the deal. It's pouring rain, and I don't know what to do, so I'm going to go back inside for a moment. Um, is the power out? I don't think the power is out, is it? No, power's good. All right, so... We just got a phone call, but I missed it because the power died, and I couldn't answer the phone, so I don't know who it was, and I'm pretty sure that uh, it's not about this guy that I stole because he escaped like a fool, and now I don't have him anymore, and now we must go find my man. Uh, but my assumption is is that it's uh, Tiamo calling about my, um, my order. My stepfather would be all over this, Keith. You'd be all over this tack. This ta oh, oh, the phone's ringing. I gotta go. Excuse me. Hang on a sec. Hello? Hello? Who is this? I'm coming. I'm coming. Hello? My dad asked you to call. Okay, I don't have a sewage truck anymore. It's in the lake. I can't help you out. Sorry. We're gonna head into town and see if that was Tiamo earlier that called. I'm gonna get all this stuff out of my truck first. Because it's just gonna fall out or cause problems. And we need to... Get ready for our other things that we have to do. Like, we're going to swap the radiator and it's going to require fluid. I'm not sure what's in this bag here. I don't remember. We should probably... Oh, good gravy. Come here. <laughs> Jeez, all right. I'm glad to be back in this game, though. I like this game a lot. What are you? What are you? Ah, brake fluid. That's good. I'll put this up here with this. There we go. Oh, you know, I should probably just put that up there with that. Okay. Okay, how are we going to do this here? We're going to put this like this this up like this and zip it in here like that and perfect okay see i like to keep extra fluids and stuff around because you never know right especially when you're dealing with the type of stuff i'm dealing with and accidents all the time <laughs> like we also got the mosquitoes harassing us again so we have to get rid of that as well but behind us on the ground over there is our our mosquito spray so that'll be fine let me see here put this here like this put that like that all right get this up here okay let's put up here with another oil there I like to keep these things around. It never hurts to have doubles, you know? I'll take the truck into town because it might rain and I'll have an accident and then I'll die and it'll be upsetting. So let's turn this ignition on. Let the glow plugs warm up while I get everything else ready. Okay. Do I have anything back here? I forget. I don't I don't remember. Oh yeah, I got oh the juice containers is back there. Are they, wait a minute, are they all back there? Or is it just that no, they're all back there, aren't they? Okay, perfect. So we're going to go to town and see if that stuff is there. Because we kind of need it. We'll just bring the juice jugs with us. Wouldn't hurt to pick up some more food either. I'm kind of running low. And I got the money for it, but I guess we'll, we'll figure that out as we go. So join me on today's adventure to Tiamo's and back with a little bit of faith. Uh, and, and hopefully some luck. We won't die. <laughs> On the way to Tiamo's. Oh! Okay. Um. There we go. Over the tracks. I just heard the train. Yeah, so I got some optimization mod because after I reinstalled the game, it ran like crap. Which is weird because it was running fine before. So I don't know what's going on with this game, but I'm glad it's working again. And then I had trouble getting it to record. Like, the whole thing has been... It's been a weird process. And it's weird. Like, I haven't upgraded my... The only thing I've, I've done to my computer... Is I added a... Uh, an audio interface... Uh, to run my new microphone. And I installed... Uh, Project Zomboid. That's it. Like, those are the only things I've, in, I've, I've done. So I don't know why this stopped working suddenly, but it did, and it's a little upsetting, but it's working again. Hopefully, I guess we'll find out uh, if this recording actually worked when I when I get out of the game. <laughs> so I guess, let me see. According to this, it's, it's recording, so I guess we'll find out. And the frame rate feels good, because I can always tell the second it drops below about 58 frames a second, I can feel it. 
Now, I, like, I, can, I run games at higher frames per second when I'm doing other things, like just playing by myself. But when I'm recording, I only do 60 because uh, the recording's only done at 60. It just makes it look better, feel better. There we go. Come on, baby. Yep, it's going to be a good day. I can feel it in my bones. It's, you know, it was raining when it started, but it's a nice day now. This is how everything should be. Nice and nice and not raining. Although I can still hear the thunder. Thunder rules. The lightning strike. No, kidding. I'm not going to say any Garth Brooks right now. I'm not even that big of a fan of country, to be quite honest. Now, I've already had the car inspected three different times now. I got my third inspection. And let me tell you about the inspections. You have to revert the car back. To its basically stock form for it to accept it like the wheels don't matter as much and stuff but the uh i can't have all this race gear on it when i go so i've had to dismantle the car <laughs> to just get through the inspection again it's kind of annoying how much fuel do i have damn it we're getting a little low passenger side fuel tank all right no problem excuse me bus Might as well fuel up while I'm here. Okay, just careful there. We don't want to hit the fuel tanks. And stop. All right, handbrake on. All right, turn the ignition off. Hello, there we go. Okay, perfect. Hey, boss, thanks for running me over that one time. I appreciate it. Okay, let's see. Is this fuel? This is diesel? Yep, there we go. I drive this thing a lot, so it might as well be gassed up. I gotta pee. Ah, kill two birds in one stone. <laughs> don't pee in the tank. Uh, nobody saw that, right? Perfect. All right, close that up. Perfect. All right, let's go see if that was Tiamo, if he's even open yet. Tiamo, buddy, what's up? Oh, look, I think you do have my thing. Hello. I only owe 63 bucks. I could get some of this, but this stuff's ugly as sin. Let's get some, uh, you know, we still have enough yeast for a few, uh, few things. Let's get a beer, okay? A case of beer. And uh, we need more food, so let's just uh, let's get all this. There we go. Okay. Can I get this, this wiener meat? No. I can't. Tiamo, stop talking, buddy. Pack of cigarettes. All right. What's this now? Pay for post order. It's thirteen hundred bucks for that. Here's for this. All right. I'm gonna take this back to my truck. Thank you. Uh, all right, so then go in there, and then we'll go grab the beer. Oh, we got two packages. See, I knew I ordered something else with that. Uh. All right, let's see here. Okay. Put this in here like this. What do we got here? Let me see. Let me see. We got this package. What is this? Oh, it's the new radiator. Yes, I knew I ordered a radiator. Sweet. You go here. Nice. And what's this? This is the new exhaust, right? Boom. All right, we're going to rush home and install these parts because that's exciting. Okay. I got all the stuff I need at home. I got all the fluids I need, so we should be fine. Let's get out of here. Oh, we need a drink, actually. Uh, excuse me for a sec. Let's just uh, have a beer while we're waiting and a smoke, maybe. Oh, probably not near the, the gas pumps like this. All right, let's have a smoke. Okay, we gotta, oh yeah, I gotta hold the button down. There we go. It's been a few days. Hey, boss. See you around, guys. Enjoy your trip. Might as well pee again while I'm waiting. Boy, I'm the worst. Drinking, smoking, pissing out in front of this guy's shop. Man, this is why I should get arrested. All right. At least those punk-ass kids ain't around. I feel like beating that guy out to death. I'm thinking I might bring my tractor one day, pick him up, and throw him in the lake. Uh, I haven't decided quite yet, but I'm, I'm, I'm figuring that one out as we go. How are we doing here? No cars. We're good. All right. Let's keep going here. Perfect. So we'll get home. And we'll get the Satsuma all, uh, all uh, fixed up here. I think I can do it in the yard, too. I don't think I need to pull it in the garage, so that's kind of cool. All right. Well, we're just about home, so we can start uh, modifying the car again, as we do. As one does. Okay, let's just slow it down. Careful. Careful. All right, turn this off. No, no turn it off. There we go. Let's 
get out of here. All right, we need a shower before we do anything and maybe have a drink. Oh, I left the doors open. This is how you get bears. Okay, there we go. Uh, Cause he gets all stressed out when he's, when he's dirty. All right, so I'll do this and then we'll start working on the car. Okay, so here we are. Ugh. Okay, that didn't work at all. There we go. Let's get these parts out here. Let's see, uh, get this out here. A new racing radiator. That's awesome. All right. And my new exhaust tip that looks like a cherry bomb from the from the 80s. All right. Sweet. All right, get that down there. Now, the muffler is going to be super easy, so we could probably do that first and relatively easily. Although, I might have to pull it in here to do that. You know what? Let's pull it in anyway. Oh, the battery fell out. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, 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 ha. Final. You get over here, battery. Okay, this battery has been glitched forever. Like, I can't... I can't even move it. That's so weird, man. Okay, hopefully it's not going to cause me a problem to run it over. I guess we're going to find out. Oh, yeah, we definitely need... Uh, definitely need... Uh, that, that exhaust on there. All right. In our driving mode. And stop ignition off. Perfect. Okay, didn't have a chance to warm up. Nice. All right, so this might be a bit close to this, but now we should be all right. So let's get the hood open just because we can. There we go. Close that. Get the hood open. Perfect. It looks like there's a dent here maybe, but I'm not sure how I would have got that. We're going to grab... This exhaust. This should be super, super duper easy to put on. Okay, let's put this here. We'll grab the tools. We gotta figure out what it's gonna take to get that off. So bring this down here for a sec. So wasn't it eight, seven, or six? We didn't try a seven. Let's try a seven. There's a mod oh there it is. There's a mod you can get. Thank you. Uh okay, there it is. That lets you know the bolt sizes when you're hovering over a part. But I try to play games without modding them because I, I want the experience that developer intended. So if it's if it's frustrating, I want it to be frustrating. <laughs> you know, I don't want it to be too easy. Nope. Okay, just get. Oh, I saw it. I had it. I had it for a second. Where is it? There it is. Oh my god, this is gonna be one of those parts, isn't it? Oh, okay, yeah, it's going to do this, and I might have to save and reload the game. Oh, no, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, let's get it up in there. Where is it? Where's the, where's the, I saw the bolt. There it is. Oh, yeah, um, F. Perfect. Okay, so that solves that exhaust problem. It's an ugly red color, but that's fine. Now, we just got to get, stop it, the radiator out. Which is going to be more of a thing. So let's uh, let's pick this up here. We we'll go back to this here. Let's pick this up. We'll bring this over here. Put this here. All right. Let's see here. What do we got for the radiator? The radiator is garbage here. Okay. Also, are we going to have to reconnect the fan? Is that is that a thing we're going to have to do? Oh no, I can't see. Let's see here. Oh yeah, the fan gets wired in. I should really disconnect the battery. Oh, no. Okay, well, we're going to have to take the battery and disconnect the battery. Because you just know I'm going to fry something if I do it otherwise. See what we can do here. Let's see. I think it's 8 mil, was it? I think. Let's see here. Yeah, we're going to disconnect. I was thinking about it. I'm going to disconnect the battery. Um, because I don't need the problems. Okay. And no, I should be able to leave it in there un unhooked up. So that's that's what we're gonna do. So now we're gonna try to go. Let's see, crouch a little bit. Let's zoom in here. I think I can just remove these clamps. I think. And then, yeah, I think I just got to use a screwdriver on those clamps. Let's see here. Okay, yeah, let's try this. Oh, yeah. 
Let's just, uh, do I have to change the direction on this or no? This is fine. And then this can come off. Okay, and then I just got to unbolt it, right? Yeah, so it's whatever size bolts those are. All right, let's try a, uh, let's try an eight mil. Let's see if that's it. No, it's not an eight. Let's try a seven, maybe? Oh, yeah, there we go. Take that out. Take that out. I got to remember to hook the battery back up. We're going to do positive and then negative. You should always do it that way. Okay, that's out and that's out. Okay. So that should allow us to remove the radiator. No, this should come off. Unless, do I got to remove the hoses? I forget. Let me see here. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, I got to figure this out. Okay, so remove both the radiator hoses. There we go. Okay, let's try that. Come here, radiator. All right, where's my new one? Um, did I leave it out there? Where'd I put it? Oh, here, that's not it. Where's it? Oh, it's out in the lawn. Or <laughs> out in the driveway, I should say. Here we go. That battery that's sitting there may not cause me any problems because I can't pick it up. It's like it's like no longer a game item or something. Okay, that can go in. All right, so then we're going to go with... Okay, we don't need that. We need a... What was it? A 7 mil, maybe? Let's try that 7 mil. Oh, wait a minute. We're going to put that back in. Then we got to get the radiator hoses hooked back up, which I'm sure is not going to be a complete pain in the ass. So now it's just a matter of the radiator hoses, which I've dropped both of them down this way somewhere. Let's see here. It's radiator hose one. Did it fall in the pit or is it still in the bottom of the car? Because I just kind of knocked them off and they fell. And then I haven't seen them since. Okay, so I don't know what happened, but I had to reload. I saved the game and reloaded. And now they're back over here. I don't know what's going on here. That's fine, though. Okay, there we go. That can go on there. And then I'll put the other one on. And then we just got to tighten the, tight, tighten, tighten the clamps. So, yeah, like, I had to look it up. Like, they disappeared. So, I looked it up, and apparently, you just reload the game, and they'll appear back where they're supposed to be if they've fallen through the world or something. Getting this one on is always a friggin' bear. Come here. Ugh. Why is this like this? Why will this one not go on? Oh, there I had it. Boom. All right, so now we need a screwdriver. Yeah, it was weird. I had to reload the whole game. So that was a little weird. Oh, yeah, put this out here and get that. All right, so put the clamp on. Clamp one. Clamp two. Clamp three and... That should be that. Okay, so now we just got to reconnect the battery with our 8mm socket. And we got to do the positive first, so let's make sure we, we look good and hard before we do that. That's positive, because that's red. That, and then this. Perfect. Okay, so now we just got to fill the radiator with uh, radiator fluid. All right, put the coolant in. There we go. Hopefully I tighten those hose clamps up. You know, that's a very, very realistic jug sound. Except you can tell they're, pull it, they're pouring it like into a plastic bucket. And I gotta remember to throw all these containers away like into the, uh, the garbage barrel outside and burn it. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna throw you over there and then we're gonna put you back on. And, perfect. Okay, just slam that down. All right. Take this to the garbage barrel. I'm going to try to move that battery again because I feel like it's going to cause me a problem. I can feel it. Hello, burn barrel. Here you go. All right. Can this battery move? Yeah, this thing got weird. It, it glitched on me very early, and it's always just been in the car, and now it seems to have fallen out. All right. Let's uh, get in, and we'll get this thing running, and then we'll get her up to operating temperature. All right. Let's enter driving mode. Come on, baby. All right. Let's, uh...
get out of the garage here. Just, oh, I ran over the battery. Perfect. Okay, we don't want it to stall. Let's. Okay, at least it's not making so much noise. Chokes on, it can just idle up here. I just want to make sure she's not going to overheat. But I don't want to go too far. What's this out here? This is a... Uh, an empty container of uh, bug spray. Let's <laughs> get rid of this. You know, we should have a, have a little fire here and get rid of some of this junk. Yeah, I got to get a new flag, so suggestions for that, because I had to reinstall the game, so... This can go back on the shelf. All these parts that I originally installed, I only had... I probably only got about three miles on them. Look at us now. Is that... It's dripping. Why is it dripping? What's leaking? Where is it leaking? I saw the leak. Where is it? Shit. Gotta make sure those things are tight, I guess. I'll double check. I wish I could see where it was leaking from. Oh, it's the oil! Shit! We don't want to run it without any oil. Come here. Oh, come. oh my god, lean forward. Okay, now that's... There we go. It stopped leaking. How, oh, shit. Now I'm probably down a bunch of oil. Oh, well, we got oil in the garage. We'll just put some oil in it. Hang on. See? This is why I always carry extra. You just never know. Oh, we didn't leak out too much, actually. Perfect. And put that back on. Just a, just a slow drip. We're fine. We're fine. See? Sometimes you, you screw things up. That's just the way it is. Don't judge me. I've been doing my best under some pretty intense circumstances here lately with how this game's been running and everything. So, leave me alone. <laughs> Let's get that choke off here. All right. How are we doing? Temperature is holding steady. I'm gonna close that door there, put this choke off. Excellent, 14.4, that's not too bad. Let's enter the driving mode here. Yeah, it, doesn't, it looks like it's holding its temperature. Excellent. Excellent. Oil pressure's good. Water's good. Oh, excellent. Okay, so let's shut this down. It's it's running. I shall leave it for one more second while I go get a drink, a victory beer. And just at the end of the day, too, as the sun goes down over another day in my summer car, Victory, where's the closet beers? I need this. Give me this. This is a good day. I might have two closet beers. Hang on a second. Here's one closet beer. Throw that over there. All right, another closet beer. Thank you. So, we did excellent work today. It does no longer sound like it's a lawnmower on crack because it doesn't have a uh, exhaust pipe on it. It's not overheating. Let's double check. Temperature is temperature's good. Fuel mixture's not too bad. You know what? I'm going to call this a win. Let's shut this puppy down. Let's see here. And we'll take it out for a rip the next time. Uh, and then we can fill out our form and get more parts. Because that's what I want. I want to get those parts I was looking at. Uh, I want to get these wheels, for example. And then I want to get... Oh, you know, maybe I get the light flywheel. I could really probably use that. But that, 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 oh, that involves removing the whole freaking engine, man. Ugh. Or at least a transmission, anyway. What's this, anyway? You know what? I'll worry about that some other time. But that's what I want. We'll do that at another point. So, I'm going to leave this episode here. So, thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave your leave a comment. Uh, tell, come join our Discord if you feel like it. You know what? I just appreciate anything you want to do. And if you didn't like this, well, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I'm not much of one. Thank you so much for watching. Love every view I get. Scapegoat. I just leaked oil all over my driveway and I don't even own any kitty litter. My parents are going to be very angry. Out.